Hey, what is going on everybody? Scudder Gaming here. Thank you very much for joining us. As you can see, I'm about to start playing a new game. This game is called East Shade. Um, it's, a, it's a bit of an interesting one. I think it's a bit like a, a sort of a, a walking simulator or an RPG without really, um, without really the RPG elements, if that makes sense. It's sort of dialogue and, and communications with people and NPCs, but you're really kind of just wandering around helping them out, I think, as far as I can make out. Um, it's new on Steam. It came out today, which is uh, the 13th of February. It's available for about £15, £16. Pounds. Um, and I'm, uh, I'm looking forward to it. It's Essentially, I'll just read you the blurb about the game. You're a travelling painter exploring the island of Eastshade. Capture the world on canvas using your artist easel. Talk to the inhabitants to learn about their lives. Make friends and help them in need, those in need. Visit cities, scale summits, unearth mysteries, and discover forgotten places. Let's get started, shall we? What's our name? Scott, dog, beautiful. Okay, um, so yeah, I know very little about this game. Reviews are, are positive. There hasn't been that many of them, though. That being said, being the fact that the game's only out today, um, but uh, we're just going to get into it and just see how it just see how it goes. I think is is what we'll do. Okay, here we are. I'm no expert, but I'm pretty sure we're on a ship. I can't interact with anything. Is that a monkey? What the hell? Okay, cool. You, I'm guessing I talk to. Forgive an old woman, but I forgot your name. What was it again? Scott Dog. Would you mind getting my book from the sleeping quarters? It would spare my bones the trip. It's called Great Voyages. You know what? I'm on it, old woman. Old woman, lady, monkey. Okay, we've got a journal. Great Voyages. The seas of the north are widely unexplored. Researchers predict these waters are expansive, and small expeditions have revealed numerous islands filled with diverse life and communities. Due to the unpredictable nature and unpredictable and violent nature of these waters, many exploration ships have lost have been lost while attempting to form new contracts and carry out scientific research. All eyes on the horizon. Property of Clara S. If found, please return. Okay. Here you go. Thank you very much. I've read this old book many times. Seems I find something new each read. And no matter how many times I've read it, it never fails to get me excited for adventure. Are you the adventuring type? Um, not really. Oh, I see. Well, this voyage must have felt twice as long for you. Can I give you a word of advice? <laughs> I'm old and wise after all. Of course you can. Uh, by all means. Adventuring is a lot more fun once you realize you need to be uncomfortable at times to have a good adventure. Captain Elona told me we'll be landing in Lindo shortly. I think we're all antsy to arrive. I mean, I'm just going to throw it out there. If that was true about being uncomfortable, all of my life would be an adventure. Um, I've just learned about a new topic. You can now inquire about this topic using the pick topic option. When it's presented, not everyone has something to say about every topic. Thanks, love. Hi, dear lady. Oh, hello. I've never been to East Shade. I've heard wonderful things about it. Did you know that the people there used to cover their mouths with garments? I've heard that since gone out of style. Quite a strange fashion fad, if you ask me. As he long as East Shade doesn't rock like this ship, I will love it. His, his lips are moving extra quick for what he's saying. Mishka, what else you got to say? It's the quaint little seaside town we'll be landing in. It's one of the many gems of the country, I hear. Bye! Almost there. Nope, nothing. Oh, that did not sound good. That didn't sound good. How do we... How do we get upstairs? Well, at least you're not panicking. Jeez, that's loud. Oh no. Don't drown anybody. I'm glad we didn't panic in that situation. Glad we all just took it on a chip. Like, very British reaction to a, 
a, a sinking ship. Did I ever tell you about the trip your father and I took to Eshade? Tell me again. Of all the trips we took, this one was my favourite, you know? If you're ever looking for a painting inspiration... I know, Mum. Tell me you'll visit one day. Promise you'll go. I promise. Think of you exploring Eshade. It makes me so happy. I know you'll find inspiration there. What an adventure you'll have. Listen, there are some places you abs absolutely mustn't miss. Be sure to paint the giant tree. Ah, I remember it like it was yesterday. How will I know which tree? You won't miss it, trust me. And the Tiffmore Bluffs. All those lovely sky country. I can picture the, you there now. An easel set and you making beautiful paintings. I hope I haven't got to paint them by hand or by mouse. Uh, these open skies and the endless seas would move any artist. Okay, I will. And the city, the magnificent building in the centre. From the very top floor, you can see the whole town and more. You won't be able to resist taking out your brushes. Ah, uh, soon. You'll be there soon. You should get some rest, Mum. Okay. I'm guessing we uh, we told our mum on our deathbed, we on her deathbed, not ours, that we would go to Eastshade. And that's what we're doing. And then, I'm assuming, that's when our ship crashed. But maybe that wasn't us. Maybe now we're dreaming. Oh, no. You've woken. I have. Are you feeling okay? You know, I'm feeling all right. Thank you. You? Do you remember what happened? Ingolf. I was traveling on a ship and it collided with Wreath. I'm glad your memory's intact. You washed up on this beach just a short while after the ship sank. One doesn't last long in water this cold. Did anyone else make it? From what I've heard, you were the only passenger misplaced during the wreck. The others are safe in town. Where are we? East Shade, of course. Specifically, my home. I usually don't take visitors, but in this case I can hardly blame you for floating in unannounced. Did any of my possessions only float in? Don't forget to take it when you leave. Even the frigid tide couldn't bring you to part from it. It must mean a great deal to you. I won't forget. I was about to head into town to share news of your survival. You should go there and let them know yourself. It's just up the path. Thanks, Ingolf. On your way, then. I very much appreciate it. Oh, look. So we've got a bag. We've got a journal. And we've got our easel. No paintings or canvases. That is bad news. Okay. So that must be our ship, I guess. I'm gonna guess I can't search this box for anything. There is there is no looting. Jeez, that's a loud bird. There is no looting, which is a, a minus point in the review, let's be honest. I would quite happily accept looting and um and loot boxes, preferably. Okay. Okay, what have we got up here? Doesn't this look pleasant? There is a lot of butterflies here. I have to say this does look quite nice. I guess that's the point of the game. If it didn't look nice, we'd have problems. Um, so, obviously we're set in this sort of fantasy world. Oh, I picked some flowers. Am I allowed to do that? I couldn't get the butterfly. I don't know if I'm meant to do that. They might be endangered. Oh well. What just happened? What's happening to me? Inspiration. Making paintings, drawings, inspiration. Gain inspiration by exploring new places and trying new things. Look at this place. Hello. Oh, on the ship. I was. You ignored me entirely. I washed up in a beach cave. Oh, thank goodness. We thought you were lost. Oh, what a horrible experience. 
I'm so glad to see you're safe. What brought you to Eastshade anyway? The boat we were just on, you moron. Um, my mother loved to hear. Of you. I came to visit my family. You look like you could use a nice cup of tea. This flavor is a bit strong for some people, but the effects can be lifted with a sip of water from your water skin. Thanks. The captain is in a terrible state. I suppose that's to be expected. Mm, she won't even leave the dock. Perhaps it would console her to know that we all survived. Probably would. Let's go speak to her. Oh, good idea. I lost most of my possessions too. And nothing has washed up. My family lives here in Lindo, so I'll be staying with them. If you find that night is coming and you're in need of a place to stay, you should check the inn. You'll be comfortable there. It gets cold around here at night. You shouldn't be out without a proper coat. I'll make one out of the flowers I just made. After that wreck, I may just settle down here for a while. Good idea. Are you wondering about anything else? No, thank you. I'm a bird! What? Did you just shout that? No, I think it was the person down there. That would have been really weird. Whoa, look at this cow. Hello, who are you? Ah, a newcomer. In the future, if you're ever in need of carriage to Nava, I'm your driver. Wow, thank you. You sound very My Russian. Ox is strong, no? Oh, it's an ox, I see, sorry. Oh, it's a chicken. Maybe not a chicken. Okay, let's go and see the bird deer. Very. Thanks. My dad says that I can do anything as long as I put my mind to it. Can you actually fly? No. So your father is a liar. Okay. Oh, look. Hey, are you an artist? What, just because I'm walking around with an easel? Are you an artist? Do you want to see what I made? Yeah, it looks a bit rubbish. Look! Um... Can I... Can I be... It's the ocean. I don't know how to do it right. It took all day. But I want to make my next one even better. What should I do? Um... I'm going to start with a nice canvas. But I don't know how to make a canvas. Let's make oh, it together. Right. You're a nice artist after all. If you don't know if I'm any good, you need to collect boards uh, and fabric. I know where some boards are. Follow me. Let's go. You're not going to take your amazing painting with you? Did you see when it ran a reef? I've never seen anything like that. A terrible waste of a good ship. I don't think it was intentional. It's amazing anyway. Oh, look. Now we just need the fabric. I don't know where to find that. Maybe we should ask someone. Okay, let's do that. Let's keep going. Good idea. Let's ask someone. What do you think? Hello? Do you have fabric? No? There's a lot of talking going on in this dock. Let's see if we can find the captain. Oh, look. Don't mind me. So we have everything we need now, right? We Shut can up. make a canvas from this stuff? Let me talk to this lady. Oh, so you've survived too. That means only one of us has been lost at sea. You just sound so upset. Who? Only the most important one of us all, Annabelle. Who the hell was Annabelle? She doesn't sound familiar. Doesn't sound... Oh, I see. She was the ship. She carries you across the oceans and you don't even learn her name. 
Annabelle. Sorry. My ship, my wooden, sea-loving daughter. Killed by the damn reefs. We came into this miserable town. Well, to be fair, it was your fault. I imagine I'll be spending the rest of my days mourning Annabelle. Sitting here. Dreaming of a world where she wasn't destroyed and people actually remember her name. Who? Okay. Off with you. <clears throat> Trade your life for hers. I mean, she was a ship. This fabric all around us, just look. Or ask that dock worker over there. Thanks, Treagle. Oh, I must now be going. It's been a pleasure. I can't be bothered. Hello, mate. Okay. Let's collect some more stuff while we're here. I mean, this has got to be stealing, right? Holy crap! Watch your step there. Lots of moving boxes around here. You're looking a little waterlogged. Guessing you just came in off of that ship. I think you even got some seaweed hanging from your ear. Uh, I'm a wreck. Yeah, we all have those days, right? I mean, uh, my dad got in a shipwreck once. He wasn't as lucky as you, though. <laughs> oh, now I feel an ass. Oh, no, he's, he's, he's fine. Just lost his leg is all. Now he gets to order us around even more. So, you'll probably be exploring all over, right? Would you do me a huge favor? I would love to. My brother loves raspberry-filled pastries. Loves them. He can't get enough, but raspberries don't grow here. So, he puts in an overseas order every two weeks. It's crazy, really. Now, the thing he hates is grape-filled pastries. I, I mean, we all hate them, obviously, but he hates them even more. He'd destroy them all if he could, you know? He once saw an old lady eating some, and he grabbed the box and threw it in the ocean. It was the craziest thing. Okay, so what I did was fill his raspberry pastry bag with, uh, <laughs> grape pastries. Can you imagine what he's gonna do when he eats one? <laughs> He'll go insane! <laughs> he's always suspicious of me doing something like this, though, so it would be perfect if you could play along and act like you're a uh, delivery person. So, um, what do you say? Will you deliver them to him? No. No, I feel like you're trying to poison him. Really? Huh. Uh, don't think of it as a prank. Think of it as a uh, bonding experience between loving siblings. No. Uh, take these anyway, just in case you change your mind. I won't. Maybe you can find someone who actually likes him. <laughs> just kidding. Everyone hates him. Sorry, mate, but, you know, you're an ass. Right. Okay, I think we're ready to make a canvas. Um, open your crafting box. We did it. Could you paint something? I want to watch a real artist. Sure. I mean, I don't know how, but sure. This looks like a good painting. How do I... This is perfect. Select a canvas to paint on. Yeah, this one. Drag to adjust, adjust the cropping. Okay. Mate, you're in the way. Unbelievable. Ser seriously, mate. Now I don't know what I need to press to paint. <gasps> Holy crap. I am... Nah. Yes. I'm going to use this for Miss Nika's next painting. She loves art so much. Hey, Miss Nika loves art like us. She always likes my paintings. I bet she'd like yours too. She really likes the eclipse. You should draw her that. What the hell is the eclipse? No, holy crap. Look how good I am. I've only got one canvas left. Now what am I doing? 
Can I sell my painting to someone? I'm, I'm a pretty good artist. What's up here? Thanks again for the canvas. No, it's my, my pleasure. I'm a bird. You're not a bloody bird. You're an idiot. Oh no. I can't fly if I don't even try. Is it wrong to paint this? You're not a bird, Lenny. You need to come down right now. That's what I told him. I said he was an idiot. You're going to get hurt. Everybody, turn around. What? Why? If you don't all turn right now, I'm gonna jump! Okay, okay. I feel like your son Everyone's needs counsel around. canceling. Canceling, counseling. I don't know what you're trying to do, but it's time to come down now. I blew! I can't believe it! I blew! Of course you did. I'm just glad you're back down. Don't How did he get down so quickly? Way. Jeez. Okay. Now that I know I can fly, I won't do it again. You should punish him, really. Okay. Whoa, look at this place. I stole your candles, I'm sorry. Hello. You must be the traveller from the wrecked ship. I am. Oh, good. Ingolf needs some visitors every now and then. I wish he would spend more time in town. But he'd rather be alone. Wouldn't we all love? Yes, I run the inn. I always keep a full stock of soup and tea to refresh weary travellers. When I was young, I travelled all over this island. I'd love to adventure again one day. Okay. I lived there for a few years, working as a baker. I do miss the bustle of the Ooh, city. Ooh, a city. Nice. nice. Okay. I think the dog workers used fabric sacks with the incoming and outgoing shipments. You might ask one of them. I just stole them, to be honest with you. It's a bit more calm than Nava. I think it's quite a nice place to relax. I think you're right. I'm very relaxed right now. Certainly. Uh, I can get a brew or I can get some, some mead. I've got no money. Do you want to buy a painting? No? Okay, fine. Hello, dude. I feel so adventurous staying here in Lendo. Well, even though you're just sitting by a fire? I live in Nava, but sometimes I just long for the primitive lifestyle Lindo offers. Seems well established How to me. How humorous you are. Thank I you. I like that in a person. I try. Some may find the story of my journey utterly inspiring. Nothing could have prepared me for the muddy paths, the unbearable heat. I even had to eat outside. Overall, it was a dreadful experience. But I braved through it all. You're quite the man. Yes, it certainly was impressive on my part. Yeah, I was thinking that. I so dearly wish my friends could see how adventurous I've become. Me too. Do you want to buy a painting? Hold on. Hold that thought. The architect of Lindlo. Lindo buildings are engineering marvels. It's difficult to construct as they are beautiful. Um, their designs of the technical endeavours are the work of eccentric genius Azad of Taria. Five years ago, this incredible architect vanished. His whereabouts remain a mystery to this day. Though praised for his, for his accomplishments in engineering and architecture, he is perhaps most widely recognised for, uh, for rare genetic facial disfigurement, polarising celebrity. Many praise his genius, while others resent his supposedly arrogant disposition. Some even claim that his notoriety is owed entirely to the disfigurement, implying that his credited skills are, in actuality, nothing more than ordinary. However, only one needs to look at the town of Lindo. Lin Lindo, so he's built something more wonderful. Well, that is quite the story again. It's locked, everybody. It's locked. Okay, cool. We Okay, let's get going. 
Now where the hell am I going, I wonder? Can I go in people's houses? I can, hello! I'm just here to look around. Are you an owl? Oh my god, you're the scariest owl I've ever seen in my life. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh, by the way, you're an idiot, kid. Ah! Holy crap. That was a loud core. Oh, no. If this isn't the bear man, I'm... Who's there? Nika? Is that you? It's not. Well, I can tell by your voice <laughs> that you're not Nika. You're being <laughs> smart with me. I was being smart with you. You must be one of the tourists. Terrible about the sinking and all that. Glad you're okay. Yada, yada, etc. Uh, but will you go get Nika, the innkeeper? I need help. Why is there a jug on your head? It's stuck, obviously. Now, would you be so kind as to go get Nika for me? I can help. Uh. Who's there? Oh, it's you. Nice. What? Brilliant. I'll wait here. Uh. Who's there? Oh, it's you. What? It, uh, it, it happens. It's fairly normal, really. Doesn't it happen to you from time to time? Not really, mate, no. But seriously, will you get the innkeeper? Ugh. <laughs> right, I've enjoyed playing with that man's emotions too much. Nika! Ah, the traveling artist. I didn't tell you that. Um. Oh, of course he does. And what is it this time? You know very well what it is. Again? See? It's like the eighth time. All right, then, we'd better go help. I'll bring the lube. Oh, man. Let's go. Who's there? Oh, it's, it's you. It's me again, mate. What? Nothing? Uh, oh, that's really stuck, isn't it? Yeah. He's yeah, a bit of an idiot. stuck. I think what we need here is some soap. Would you be a dear and fetch some soap from a means house? It's just down the stairs and across the courtyard. Oh, God, what's wrong with the people in this town? Okay, let's go. I'm running for the soap. Hello? I need some soap. Hello there. Can I help you, Traveller? Still a scary owl. Soap? Well, certainly. May I ask why? The moron across the way got his head in the jar. He did? Hmm. Is he a friend of yours? No, I like taking the mickey out of him. Ah, well, I shouldn't gossip then. He's just such a peculiar man. And you know what? I think Lenny is going to have some real issues. Oh, when this he is the kid up. who. He's dad. Well, you've seen him. The boy is unhinged. He is. He and tried to jump off that. a building. I've been hearing a lot of yelling coming from that house. I think it's quite a broken home. You know, I imagine you'll be travelling all around this island, being a tourist and all. Perhaps when you get to Nova, you should let the sheriff know about Isan. I think it's only right, you know, for Lenny. You want Lenny for yourself. Well... It's a small town. If word ever got back to Isan that I was the one that reported him, things might be a little awkward, being such a what close a bitch. neighbor and all. <sighs> a 
Of course, you're right. I suppose it's a bit selfish of me to worry about a little awkwardness when it's a matter so serious. I'll head over to Narva as soon as I get the chance. These things stuck on her nipples. Right. Well, here's some soap. Thank you. Safe travels. Oh my god. I think I leveled up. Whatever the hell that means. Okay, let's go again. I've got the soap, everybody. You have the soap? I have the soap. Well, let's try this thing then. Here, let me have that soap. You have the soap. Well, I guess it was convenient that you dropped in when you did. Uh, thanks for getting Nika. Well, you are a nosy tourist, aren't you? Beeswax! Yeah, let's tell him. You mean? That nosy, stuck-up, goody, two talon uh, If you had to deal with what I have to deal with... She just doesn't like me because I'm not posh like her. This whole town is stuck up. Them and all their judging eyes. You know what? Get out of my house. You're just like everyone else in this town. Whoa. Coming in here and telling me I'm a bad father? Get out. I know that's what you meant. Just get out. Have you ever thought about putting your head in here? No? Okay. Fine. Well, this has been a very eventful day. Um, I have to say. Now I don't know what to do, mind you. Oh, we got someone to talk to again. I saw you talking with the captain. How is she doing? That doesn't surprise me. She's lost her home and her career in one fell swoop. Yeah, and Annabelle. How have you been? Oh, right. Um, I think the dock workers use fabric sacks with the incoming and outgoing shipments. You might ask one of them. I want more. His disappearance was all very mysterious. I don't believe anyone's seen him in a long time. Let's go in this building. Because it does look pretty impressive. I can fly! Oh, I won't do that. Look at this. Okay, let's go downstairs. Okay, should we head out? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Here's what we're going to do, everybody. We're going to put a cut in here and then we're heading out into town. No, out of town. We could head to the city, but I think we'll just have a wander around. Um, thank you very much for watching this. I hope you enjoyed it. Please let me know your thoughts. Um, please go and check out the uh, the Twitch channel and follow me there. You can uh, see the link below. Um, and we will see you again soon. Thank you. <laughs>